Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to do a huge Japanese staff haul. My mom came from Japan for my graduation commencement and she brought so much stuff for me. So I guess I'm gonna share that with you. And if you enjoy Japanese food or Japanese stuff, please give a like and subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to do more videos. So yeah, let's get started. I didn't even like organize everything, so it's gonna be just like random. But first, we have this, it's called umeboshi, the pickles plum, I think in Japanese. I love those. She gave me two packs of those. Um, this is great for rice and other stuff too. Next, we have kinako. Kinako is powdered soybeans, like dried soybeans. This is also good for sweets, snacks. You can mix with milk. Next, this is powdered ginger. She said I can put it in drinks or soup. But this is supposed to be like a healthy, good for your nutrition. Next, we have hatomugi. It says I can just eat it like this. What's even hatomugi? I'm just gonna look at it in, Jap in English. I guess it's like crunchy snacks. Next, we have so many amazing snacks from Muji. I love Muji. And in Japan, they have this low carb snacks for you. So I ordered a bunch online and my mom picked it up for me. So I have enough snacks for the next month or so. Next up, we have many caffeine, non-caffeine teas. These are decaf teas. Um, I like drinking coffee in the morning, but sometimes I try not to. Sometimes I want to drink something other than other than coffee, but I don't want to have caffeine. Um, in that case, I love to have decaf tea. So my mom sent me a bunch. Those are beans tea. This is hojicha tea. So I'm very excited to try those. They're, they look really nice. Next up, we have assorted rice. Um, so this is like the pack of the things that you mix when you cook the regular rice. I normally cook brown rice. By mixing those, it has more... I don't even know how to call it, <laughs> but... It's like really mixed with other grains, so it's supposed to be good your digestion. I'm very excited to try those. Next up, we have namaja. I miss those packaged teas in Japan. There's some teas or like a canned tea in, in here that I can buy, but it's it's different and I, I prefer like not sugary drink. So this is good. My mom bought this at the airport. She was gonna drink it, but she didn't finish it. So I'm just like, can I, can I just give it? So um, yeah, thank you, mom. Next up, we have matchas. I really wanna get into my matcha kicks. I watched this um, YouTube channel. It's called Sane, Sane Violet. I'm sorry if I mispronounced it. She has her own matcha company. It's called Nekohama. It's so delicious. I tried it once. It was really, really nice. But I'm also a college student who, who hasn't secured a job yet. So I'm, I haven't been able to buy those for myself. But luckily my mom's from Japan. I'm from Japan. My mom was super kind to gift it for me. So those are by Tsujiri. Tsujiri is a very famous company in Japan. So yeah, my mom got a bunch of those for me and I should be able to make matcha latte for the summer. Very exciting. Next up, I have so many snacks. First, we're gonna go to those vegetable chips. This one is Gobo. I forgot. Those are really healthy chips. Yeah, and it has a good fibers. It says they are really good for the salad as well. Maybe I should try putting in my salad. And this is the sweet potato chips. I love Japanese sweet potatoes. Not like, no offense, but like American sweet potato doesn't really have much taste and kick that I, I used to have. So, and those are good sweets, snacks. Yeah, it's really, really sweet and they don't put any sugars in it. They only have sweet potato but it's so sweet that I almost like wonder if there's any sugars in it but there's no and next one we have this matcha kinako nejiri I don't even know how to explain it but basically it's like um it's like a candy but like a chewy candy with kinako the soybean and matcha I'm very excited to try those bottles um where should I even start um those are the barbecue sauce the Japanese barbecue sauce 
If you go to like a Korean barbecue, they give you like a sweet, savory, like a soy sauce based sauce. Those are like that. Um, they're really, really good. I, I love it. So whenever I cook veggies, roasted, I like to put a little bit of those, or I mix it with my salad. Those are really, really useful. Next up, we have dressing, Japanese dressing. Shiokoji. Uh, Shiokoji is next up. We have menzu. Menzu. I still have it in my fridge. My mom sent me my bunch, so I'm just gonna keep it. I'm sure. Yeah, it lasts more than a year, so I should be able to use those. And I'm in summer. I'm planning to cook more Japanese noodles, so those are really good for a soup. I have more miso soup. Those are from Muji as well. It's called Nanashuru Nanashu no Miso Shiru Asoto. So each packet has seven different flavors of miso soup. I'm very excited to try those. Those are really good for when you're in hurry and you wanna, you don't want to cook that much food. I'm very excited to try those. Next up, we have Genmai no Taberu Soup Asoto. Uh, this is like a porridge, like an oatmeal, like a oatmeal but with rice. Yeah, it has a brown rice. And one is uh, Japanese style soy sauce vegetables. And the other one is a chicken broth. Those are really good when you're like hungry at midnight and just want to eat something light but don't want to cook. Those are really, really good. Next, next up, we have Manji Tsukaitai Kuzefuku no Tashi. This is a broth. This is a fish broth. I wonder how I should I use this. But yeah, maybe I should cook more like a Japanese food for sure. Okay, next up, we have. Soba, the soba noodle. I know it's it's been really famous in especially like LA. So many like healthy YouTubers, influencers, they eat so much soba for like dinner and stuff. The reason why is apparently like soba wheat is good for your digestion and healthier than healthier than other like traditional pastas. So I I got a bunch of those. It's super cheap in Japan compared to here, and it's more like higher quality. So I'm very excited to cook more soba in during during summer. Next up, we have brown sugar chestnuts, kokuto kurumi. This is another snack. It's called sugar coated with the like a higher quality brown sugar from Okinawa. <laughs> it's so funny. It says the walnuts is actually from California. So it's so funny that my mom brought it from me, but the walnuts is actually from America. It's like, I don't know, it, it's just funny. We're moving to other than food items. 90% <laughs> is just food, so this is very short, but uh, we have sheet mask. Rurun pure. Rurun pure. So those are the sheet masks my mom bought for me and my housemates. Um, we have three types of sheet masks. Yes, this one is the most like basic one. It's just like it says balance. So it's good for any type of skins. And this one is a clean one. It makes it's supposed to make your skin cleaner and like more brighter, I think. And this one is moist. If your if your skin is super dry, you can use this to make your skin more moist. <laughs> yes, um, it's very very nice, sweet on my on my mom to buy us so much seat mask, and I'm very very excited to use this more because my skin is breaking up. Next up, we have sunscreen from Japan. Next up, we have toners. This toner is like super basic in Japan. It's like a drugstore toner. I really, really love this. I, I've been using this since high school. And it's like, it's supposed to be like $7 each for like this huge toner. So I love, I don't use any other toners other than this. Next up, we have more pouch from Muji. Muji has such a nice pouch or like dividers, I, wish, I should say. It's like, if you open this, it goes like, it has so many pockets and dividers. So I have one for the basic use and I wanted to get one more for more like a tech gadget stuff. So yeah, I asked my mom to bring me one. I'm very happy to have one of those again. Yeah, I think that's it. I'm super grateful for my mom to bring this all from Japan. And thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give us a like. I really, really appreciate it if you can subscribe. And thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.